Hi everyone, this is Uma coming to you with your weekend reading for Saturday, December 9th and Sunday, December 10th, 2017. I am using the Angel Tarot card deck and I will be pulling some cards from some other decks as well. So let's get right to it. I have been doing some readings. My decks are ready to go. So we're setting the intention that we are pulling for, let's first go with Saturday, December 9th. Yeah, let's go with Saturday, December 9th, 2017. Um, what is your general reading? What is the general energy of Saturday, December 9th? Thank you, Spirit. We have the Renewal card. The Renewal card talks about reviewing and evaluating a favorable assessment and moving in a new direction. This is really great because um, I just did a couple of readings for Friday, December 8th, and we had one of the cards was release, like letting go, spiritual transformation. So on Friday, we don't really see a lot of movement. We see like the cutting of cords, letting go of things to the past, um, things that were holding you back. But now we start to see the movement on Saturday. Okay. We have Queen of Earth and Ace of Air. So some promising things coming in on Saturday. Queen of Earth, you see the Fairy Queen holding um, a pot of gold in her magic and she is making time for people around her, dealing with challenges and the kind of understanding matter, um, but just really being sensible and taking a warm and friendly kind approach. Ace of Air talks about challenging beginnings but the start of something new. So I feel that on Saturday, we're going to see opportunities come up your way um, for advancement, either in relationships or in the work field. And it may be challenging or it may not be an easy start, but it's a start. Okay. And again, it's following that renewal card, right? Moving in a new direction. So something about Saturday has new opportunities coming your way and what I'm really hearing from spirit is don't shoot it down because it doesn't come to you the way you want it to come to you. Accept it. Whatever it is, accept it because it's an opportunity for abundance. Okay? All right. Now let's pull for Sunday. The energy of Sunday, December 10th. Four of air, rest, meditate, take some more time before making a decision. So Sunday has um, a very relax at home, chill out, stay on the couch, kind of couch surf on Sunday kind of feel. Page of fire, news of an exciting new opportunity, another opportunity coming your way because we had ace of air on Saturday which talked about new ideas and inspirations and new beginnings and page um, pages are the same as aces they're both beginnings but pages bring messages so getting some messages about a new opportunity on Sunday as well and five of water things not turning out the way you'd hope crying over spilt milk you know, um, not seeing the positive in a situation. I like this card. I know a lot of people don't like this card, but I like it because it it's not a negative card in terms of, oh, you know, things are just so terribly wrong. It's more a card of you're lamenting over, you're crying over spilt milk. So it's not happening to you in the moment in time. It's something that happened in the past. Let it go. Whatever it was, let it go. Okay. Um, so I feel that you, and because this is a relationship card, I feel that you and your significant other will be having a talk on Sunday and somebody's going to bring up the past and you're probably going to be like, oh, that shouldn't have happened or how could you or shoulda, woulda, coulda. Don't, don't go down all of that. Okay, don't, because do, you, you can see from your other cards, it's draining your energy. Just let it go. Okay, I want to pull some clarifiers on the renewal energy. For Saturday, yes, healing begins. So Saturday when we pulled that renewal card about moving in a new direction, it's because you're allowing yourself to heal. You're allowing yourself to heal over whatever the situation was um, that has been plaguing you for a while. And I want to pull a renewal um, 
a clarifying card on Ace of Air and Queen of Earth as to what is this new opportunity coming to you on Saturday? What is this new opportunity on Saturday? Ace of Air, clarifying. Thank you. I'm going to go with this one. Blossom. Okay, that is a really great card. I mean, just look at it. How beautiful is that? So I feel that you're manifesting something on Saturday. It's something that you've wanted for a long time. Something you've been really thinking about and praying on and just hoping and wishing for. It's coming true. It's definitely coming true. Okay. And then we're going to clarify Queen of Earth. Feeling helpless and hopeless. So, you know, the Queen of Earth card, as we said on here, it's about making time for those around you and dealing with challenges in a kind and in a kind and understanding manner. So as much as your manifestations are coming through on Saturday, you're having this change of energy, you're having your healing begin, there's going to be someone around you that is going to be still a bit of a challenge. And you don't have to feel helpless and hopeless. You don't have to feel that way. Just deal with the challenges in a kind of understanding manner um, while you work on your healing. Okay, so let's clarify the four of air, which is on Sunday, taking a rest, taking a vacation. Let's see what spirit wants to tell you about that. Yeah, observe. So what's happening on Sunday is that spirit is asking you to step back and really just evaluate, meditate introspect, reflect, journal write if you must about what is happening in your life. It really feels like the chaotic energy of Mercury retrograde is messing with you on Sunday because um, it just feels like you're in your mind. You're in your mind a lot and spirit is reminding you, is it true? Because if it's in your mind, is it true? Now let's clarify page of fire. The news of an exciting new endeavor on Sunday. We get the de de detach card, the detach card. So that is going with page of fire. So what does that mean to me on Sunday? The news of an exciting new endeavor, it's not here yet on Sunday. You're going to hear about it. It could be something like you're hearing about a new job opportunity opening up where you can travel or something that's just going to be so amazing that you want it. You just want to have it. But Spirit is saying, don't get too attached to the outcome. Don't struggle. Don't, you know, try to persist or push on it. Just see it. Observe. Going back to that observe card. Right? Be like, oh, that's interesting. Observe, detach, and allow your heart to feel, you know, all the fun things a heart can feel about the situation. But don't get so caught up in it that you lose your joy and you lose your happiness. And finally, let's clarify this five of water card. Things not turning out the way you'd hoped. Not seeing the positive in a situation. What does spirit want you to know about that? Yeah, that's exactly what I was saying. We got the success and growth card. So whatever this thing is that you're lamenting in a love relationship from the past, let it go because you guys are on a different path now. You're on a path to success and you're growing together. So whatever it was, just let it go. It's, it, there's no room for it. Absolutely no room for it. Okay, so your weekend and summing up your weekend, it just looks really full of change and transformation on a spiritual level. But if you come through this, really allowing yourself to rest, rejuvenate your energy, tap out from social media, tap out from other people and just concentrate your energy on healing, you can come out of this weekend feeling really good about yourself and also having these opportunities come your way and you'd be in a better place to take advantage of them, if that makes sense to you guys. All right, that is your weekend reading. The general re reading for Saturday, December 9th, Sunday, December 10th, your general reading. In a minute, I'm about to do the Twin Flame reading for the weekend. So if you want to get all my readings, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and that way you can get all the readings. Thanks, guys. Talk to you soon.